Hi, I'm Catherine Palermo. During the last five years as one of your city court judges, I've worked hard to earn your vote. I have handled every type of case that can be heard in city court, both criminal and civil, and I've presided over bench trials and jury trials. I received excellent reports from my two supervising judges, culminating in my own promotion to supervising judge, effective January 1, 2017. I now supervise the town and village justices of Oswego County, and I'm acting Jefferson County Court Judge. I created a domestic violence court. The creation of that separate calendar resulted in securing a coveted spot at an annual two-day symposium on domestic violence matters, and having the privilege of meeting with a team from the Office of the Statewide Coordinating Judge for Family Violence Cases. We discussed the expansion of the Domestic Violence Court and the assistance the State Office can provide. The creation of that court will also bring training for the local attorneys practicing in City Court. There is tremendous state and federal support for domestic violence courts, and I'm proud to say that the creation of this court has brought additional resources to our area. During the last five years, I have made myself available at all hours to handle arraignments when court was not in session. This keeps our police officers patrolling the streets instead of sitting with an arrested person until court is in session. Lastly, I have earned your vote by treating everyone who comes to court with respect and dignity. In addition to the codes and rules we all live by, judges have special rules compiled in the rules governing judicial conduct. Those rules include the dictate that a judge shall be patient, dignified, and courteous to litigants, jurors, witnesses, lawyers, and others. And that applies both on and off the bench. People must have confidence in the judiciary. When you walk into a courtroom, you are entitled to feel the certainty that you will be treated fairly, that you deserve equal treatment under the law. I have protected your rights. Through hard work, dedication, and the application of the law equally for all people, I have earned your trust, your confidence, and your vote. I have the dedication that can only come from the gratitude and love I feel for the job that has been entrusted to me. I humbly ask for you to vote for me on November 7th, 2017. Thank you.